Yo, what up guys, how you doing? Alright, shout out to all my Aurora fans who are here. Today we're doing something unique. So you guys always say that you should check out some of our interviews. What a better way to check them out than with you. So today, let's get into some of Aurora. What does it say? Aurora being herself in interviews for three minutes straight. Three minutes, okay, let's get into it. What other things are you doing? Um, well, I like to paint, I like to read books and cook and masturbate. <laughs> hey, you played Good in the Moo in the country in April. Uh, how was regional Australia? I find all of Australia incredibly beautiful. Mm. And it's, 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 um, it's very fascinating to me how nature can be so different from country to country and still within the country also so different. Mm. We've been dry, we, we were uh, droving. Droving? Driving. No, no, droving. We were drawing. <laughs> we'll go with that. We yes. were. <laughs> yes, I'm always right. Um, Did you see any birds in Canberra? There's a lot of uh, galahs. I saw a lot of birds, mm. and one bird really frightened me. It was quite huge. Looked like a crow. Quite mm. dark in the f in its feathers, mm -hmm. um, and it made this sound, which sounded like a little boy shouting. Ah! Like it was really, really weird. Haunting. And I, yeah, it was quite haunting. I've been struggling with sleep since then. <laughs> <laughs> Are you good cameras? Are you good at running? Mm? Yeah. yeah. I went too far. Kitty, pause. Ah, <laughs> oh, 73. And I will live on a mountain with a cat. Uh, sheep's eye? No, no way, man. <laughs> no way. Some love and hold me tight. I always lose my shoes. Once I forgot my shoes before I went to the to the city. Not a good idea. Love, give me some love and hold me that I had an incredible mustache. <laughs> give me some love and hold me, give me some love. Many times. If I'm in a place where I can't find a forest, then I like to go within myself. Meditating helps a lot, and also doing yoga. But I like to watch uh, trees, because they... they... <laughs> okay, I, I like to watch trees. spend the night oh. beside It's a jump. <laughs> Hold for it. Don't hold back. Ah, yeah. I think it's a jump. What song is it? Galvanized. Aha. Uh -huh. Says that she's been there all night. And she's also been there all day. Not to jump. Ah. That sound that they use on every song, like that snare, so ugly. Interesting that you should mention it being kind of nature-esque. Uh, I was going to ask you a bit later in the interview. Um, I came across something that said that you stayed with Tom Rowland, kind of freaked them out a bit by going on a really long walk in the woods and disappearing. Is that something that, while you've been on your travels, have you found any kind of particularly special... In Man, interviewing you. <laughs> You'll be, be like, what the hell? Places like that. Um, oh yes, I have. Sometimes on festivals, it's easier to find. Yeah. So if, it, uh, if your environment influences uh, you, kind of the music that you're writing and the art that you're making, do you have any sort of particular rituals that you follow to um, to kind of uh, shape what you're writing at that time? Well, I don't know. Ah, man, come on. See how she was there? Ah, come on, you can't do that. You have your, ah, come on, man. Now you're the, ah. Imagine, ah. When kids do it, it's weird. You know how when kids are sucking them, and then they, they want to touch you, like, yo, don't do that. And then, like, a grown person doing that. Like, hey, I fell for the interview. Like, she just looked at it like, I gotta be professional because I gotta pay my rent. <laughs> But then for her, she's just having fun and being a soft soul. It's, 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 
it's a mixture this was yeah this was interesting i should check out more for interviews like the way she, this one started where she's like oh i must have been you know when someone says anything sexual it, it's always weird like how do you respond to that like, uh -huh. out of the blue especially if you're not expecting it or the drumming <laughs> but only she can say stuff like that and get away with it because you know you know you know in a way it's like okay we that's that's the beauty of of being someone like Aurora. Like people would just be like, "Oh, that's Aurora being Aurora." You know, if if you did it, I don't know how people would react to it. But I guess that's what what happens when you're authentic and you don't really hide who you are, and people will accept you for that. You know, I feel I stand to be corrected. But this was fun. Let me know. Leave me some links. To check out other videos that are not a music, but like where she's being funny and stuff like that. And yeah. With that said, guys, uh, if you're new around here, smash the subscribe button. Leave us a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of this. I'll see y'all next time.